Uh, hey guys, Shea Bear 1000 here. Let's build a solar car together. Okay guys, this is that, uh, that little solar car that we bought. Uh, we got it half off. They had three on it. I got it for $1.50. Uh, we bought it at that really cool, uh, it's like a repurposed shop. So this is where we bought that at. Uh, I didn't see a rubber band. It's supposed to come with one, but I didn't see one. So hopefully, you know, I can find one of these that will work in it. So let's open this up. Now, we've got a... tape off of here okay it looks pretty easy and simple I kind of read over the instructions a little bit already so let's see I don't know how this comes out or anything I think it's been put together before because like there's a straw in here that shouldn't be in there and I don't know why so maybe we'll find out so we've got all these little straws in here we've got our little alligator clips but other than uh, let me see I think something is missing but I can't remember what so I'm going to need two of them long ones and two of the small ones so it looks like those four will do. Um, let's see. Here's the wheels. And this is our solar panel. Okay. This is our little motor. Okay. Now we've got just get all this stuff out here and we'll just kind of set it here we've got our two wires so I think it's all here other than the rubber band okay these things you can get them between five and I think seven dollars online so I got it for a buck fifty. Even three dollars would have been fine. There's the instructions, but here's the car. If you get it and it's not been used, it'll it'll be like that, and you just cut that off in there. Okay, so we start down here. I'll go ahead and open this up so you guys can see what we're going to do first. It kind of tells you about it. Disclaimer: This is in no way to entice children or intended for children this is for adults for what kids 13 and up or whatever this is not to entice children oh my lighter got real big I lit it yesterday and it was like okay so that's not what this is intended for this is me I'm an adult doing this with adults okay so Alright, I don't even want to show the kids on here. This is stupid. So anyway, so we get the front of the car. We've got to do the bottom. See, here's the front. So we got to flip it over. <coughs> Excuse me. And we're going to use these. This is for the axle. Alright, and the long one is for the front. It's for is the front axle. like that now apparently okay the two shorter straws one's going to go on here oh shit one's going to go on here one's going to go on here now we're going to put our two smaller wheels right here Okay. Let's see, 
it so like it goes like this hmm that's pretty pretty tight there guys okay whatever oh look it just broke it just broke son of a bitch hmm This one went on nice. This one was kind of what's it supposed to do. All right. So now the next step is to I want to put this on the center of the axle. It's real tight. Yeah, see now look at my wheel. Because it's fucking broke. Jesus Christ. Whatever. Alright, so it's going to go like that. So we're going to put two of the longer straws on here. Like this. Then we're going to put these little deals on and then we're going to put a rubber band on but I don't know what size we need to use you know what I mean so let's go ahead and put this on for now so that way we can check out what size we're going to need alright now the motor is going to go here which is going to go like this okay go underneath Oh, okay, so this goes, I don't know what I want to do about that fucking wheel. This goes on the top of the car. Like that. And the rubber band goes here. Yes, yeah, it says top, not bottom of car. So, like that. Let's see what kind of rubber band we're going to need here. Let's see. Let's try this one. This one may work. Now I'm trying to like bend around the camera and I don't have to do it anymore so See, that may be too short. Shouldn't be, though. Alright, anyway. Let's go ahead and put this back on. Where's my... There it is. put our rubber band on here I mean that should work right you would think still don't know what I'm going to do about this damn wheel I guess I'll try to super glue it Man, that sucked. That sucks, I should say. Anyway, I'm going to get some glue and we'll glue that. But first, let's keep going. Alright. Now, the next step is to hook up our, uh, our solar panel. Which is going to go on the top of the car like this ok 
Okay, just like that. Now we've got to we've got to put our wires here. I don't even know if that wire is any good or not. We'll put one here. And it'll run both ways. It'll run backwards or forwards. So just put the wire around there. Let's start this first. But seeing a picture, you can see they've got it in a different spot. See, that's behind the axle. This one's right underneath the axle. That's okay. We'll see if we can get this to work. Alright, there's one wire. Now let's get our other wire here. Just like, uh, see, this one's going to be a pain. Let's start the nut first. So it wasn't too bad. Now we're going to tighten this nut down. Alright, just like that. Now we're going to put our alligator clips on. With these little tiny screws. So let's get a little tiny screwdriver here. Boy, those are tiny. Super duper tiny. So it goes just like that. This is fun. I hate that noise though. Alright, now we'll screw this one on. Just like that. they've got it they've got the motor on this side it doesn't really matter they said it's just an extra set of holes in case one set or one set of holes wears out let's see if this thing's going to run on the light from the garage here nope guess not yeah, it sucks that tires, that wheel screwed up. So that's how you do that. Now, let's take it outside and see if we can get this thing to get the motor to work or whatever. You know, so. Oh, and there's a way you can tape a battery. You can use a battery on here, too, by taking these off and just putting a battery on top here somewhere. Well, it says to put it underneath, but... You know, you can use a battery for it. I have a battery here. Uh, had a battery. Um, okay, so let's let's just try it for the hell of it. And make sure that motor's going around. Okay, so the motor does run. Alright, so let's take it outside. And see if we can get it to work on the sun. The sun's going down, so I don't know how well it's going to work.
All right, let's take it outside. Okay, guys, so we're looking for some sun, and there's the sun up here. So we kind of got right there's full sun, and it doesn't seem to be working. Okay. It also says that you can put a piece of uh, aluminum foil on cardboard and shine it at it, and it's supposed to help it go. But I mean, I think that's plenty. The way it's sitting right there, it should it should be running it. But it's not. So, what we're going to do is, we're going to tape the battery on it. Okay? So let's go in the house and tape the battery on it so we can see it run around. Alright guys, I couldn't find my super glue. So we're going to try this out. It says it'll set in five minutes. So let's see. It's supposed to... Um, it's instant mix. It mixes in this tube as it comes out of the tube, so... I'll give you a look at that here in just a second. Okay, so... I don't know if you can see that, but that's what it's supposed to do. Uh, anyway, it mixes inside the tube, so... sure I'm doing this right just snap that off and screw that on huh? that's what it says to do hold syringe with nozzle end up okay snap off by pushing to one side. Do not twist. <laughs> okay. So hold it up like this and snap that off. Oh, okay. I see. Okay. There's the two little holes. One for each side. And then we take this and we put that on. And here's the cap. Cap for it, it looks like. Alright, now, see it coming out there guys, maybe like this, it's clear, so. oh, oh shit, oh shit, there we go, well, damn it, okay, alright, I'll probably just glue my damn knife shut. We'll find out. Okay, so. Alright, so it should have mixed. Alright, so we're gonna put this on here. And I'm gonna pull it back a little bit so it doesn't keep wanting to come out. It's kind of a cool design, but I don't think I'm liking it for the simple fact that. It's getting everywhere. Was it worth a buck fifty? Hell, I don't know. I'll give you two of those things, so. I'd like to put it on here first and then let it, you know, so it don't break again, but yes, yeah, that's, that's not going to work. So, what we're going to do is we're going to let that set up and try to get it and try to get it put back on the axle because I've got this battery here, it's C cell, but it'll work. Because uh, from when we tried it a minute ago. Cool. 
and also if you want this thing to go in circles you just take one of these and put it back and put one a little more forward like that and it turns the wheels and it will go in circles so that's what we're going to try so I'll be back with you in five minutes to see if that stuff's going to work or not and give it a little more room there okay so stick with me guys okay guys so that that stuff there worked really well I mean it started setting up in about five to seven minutes like it said in 20 minutes it's pretty much fully cured I've got the battery taped on here and okay so let's take this outside and we're gonna put it down on the ground and we're gonna watch it go in circles hopefully <laughs> I haven't tried it yet so we'll see Clip. <laughs> That's funny. I wish the solar thing would work. It might in full sunshine, but there it is. That's pretty cool. <laughs> All right, so we built a solar powered car even though it's not working off the sun but maybe the sun just wasn't bright enough i don't know so anyway there's that guys there's another video for you and yes i was using my my thing there and i kept forgetting i, st I was like still reaching like i was reaching around i'm like there's nothing to reach around now so yeah that's um that's pretty cool Okay, we're doing a whole shot all right guys there you go we built a car so thanks for watching guys i appreciate it remember shea bear the myth the man legend i'm gone for now um i guess that's all i got for you so don't forget to check out monkey 1000's channel she's working on a video right now and i think she may be doing another one so we'll see so thanks for watching guys appreciate it y'all have a good one peace